getting ready with me on holiday for dinner. Open my windows. Oh, I did that the wrong way around. What do we think of the staying home fit? I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm genuinely so burnt. Now I'm gonna pick out an outfit. I don't know if I told you guys, but I'm in Djibouti. My last vlog, I was in Tunis. I mean, no. No, I wasn't. <laughs> My last vlog, I was in Dubai. It was a travel vlog. I'll film another one when I'm going back to London. But now, we're filming a Get Ready With Me. Thinking shorts or skirt or dress, guys. I have no idea. I know for sure I'm doing a slick back because it's too hot. Kind of gonna wear this shirt. It's like a new shirt I got. It's like this. It's so cute. Kind of want to wear that, but I'm not sure because I brought actually quite a few tops with me. I think this is the one. We're gonna wear this shirt and then we're gonna figure out bottoms. I just put on the shirt. I love it. This is the first time I wear it. I literally got it two weeks ago when I was shopping for spring break and this is the shirt. I love it so much, but now I need to find bottoms. But I'll just film once I've picked out my outfit. I think I figured it out. I think I'm gonna wear these shorts. I kind of like this. Like it adds contrast, you know, between the two colors. I like it. Plus I'm tan, so it looks so cool. So we have the fit and now we're gonna get our face ready. We're gonna brush my teeth, so yeah. I'm gonna be using the ordinary hyaluronic acid. I'm just gonna put some drops because my skin is not really good at the moment. I'm like getting, I got a pimple there. Not, not feeling good about that. Um, how has your guys' break been going? Spring break is going good, but oh guys, I be not the vibe. I have to do stuff for my IAs, working on my EE, personal statements, all of that. But you know what? I don't know if it's just me, but like I've been enjoying writing my personal statement and my EE. Like those are two things, like I don't know. I've been actually finding joy in doing that. So yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna moisturize my skin with this. It's just the simple moisturizer. Dubai was so fun. And now I'm in Djibouti, so yeah. Been really getting in the heat before going back to London. <laughs> I'm really tan, like I haven't been this tan in so long. Like I'm naturally not a very like light skin person, but like now like I'm just seeing myself and I'm like wow, like I'm so tanned. Okay, now we're gonna put on some sunscreen. Yeah. Oh, I didn't show you what it is. Yeah. Okay. So that's the sunscreen. I'm gonna use this. It's basically a dupe, a Benetint, you know, but it's like darker because the Benetint, okay, why is it not focusing? As I was saying, the Benetint, it's very like light and I don't feel like it's very pigmented. And then I found this dupe like on Amazon. I'm trying to get like these travel size ones. This is like tiny, like it's perfect for traveling. And it's a lot darker. Like I literally put so little and then like it just adds like a little hint to my lips. Now, obviously, we're gonna put some. Honestly, I don't think I need to put on blush because I'm already burnt. I'm probably gonna put on some blush on the sides though. It's just some powdered blush. Yeah. Put on highlighter because that is my favorite thing in the world. I love highlighter. I feel like highlighter just adds so much to the face. I don't know how to explain it, but I love it so much. Winter, summer, spring, fall, highlighter is the go to for everything. I love highlighter. And then once again, I'm gonna go to my fingers to make like, I like to make my nose really defined with highlighter. So yeah, we're doing that. Oh, my pimple is so visible. How nice. Whatever. We're gonna embrace it, I guess. Doesn't make that much of a difference, does it? No. Okay, that's fine. Actually, no, we're gonna cover it up. I'm just gonna use the Maybelline Fit Me. Just gonna quickly use that. To even it out, I guess. I'm just gonna blend it. Okay, perfect. Now you can't really tell it's there. I mean, you kind of can, but like, whatever. It's fine. I did my best. Now we're gonna go in with the Jumbo NYX white liner. We're gonna use that to just line the waterline of my under eye. I feel like it just accentuates like my eyes, especially because I have brown eyes. I feel like it just makes them stand out a bit more. It makes my eyes 
pop. Okay, um, what else am I gonna do? Oh, I'm gonna use this. It's basically the lip balm which adjusts to your pH levels. I love it. You can use it as a blush too. I have one in my school bag that I use during the day. It's so good. I love it. So cute. And it's like quite a natural looking color. It's not too vibrant, if you know what I mean. So yeah, we love that. Okay, I think that's basically it for makeup because there's nothing else to really do. Now I'm gonna do my hair. Okay, so I just brushed out my hair and I, I wanna try, you know where you leave the two strands out and then you braid them? I really wanna try that because I've seen people do it and it looks so good. I never tried it, but I wanna like do it slick back and then have those two out, you know? But how do I do that? Okay, I'm a bit lost on how to do this. I'm not really good with hair, guys, in case you can tell. But yeah, we're gonna do with what we have, I guess. I think that's fine. I'm gonna put those there. And now I'm gonna put gel. This is the gel I use, VO5. Yeah, so I'm gonna start the slip back process. Okay. Let's go. I've never done it like this, because usually I just put the gel everywhere, but now because I'm leaving the two strands in the front, I don't know what I'm doing, but it's okay. I'm probably doing this completely wrong, so if I am, please tell me how I should be doing this. Wow, I look so nice. You have to be so careful when you're doing this to not get these strands. I'm sure there's probably an easier way to do this, and I just don't know how to do it. Okay, we'll brush, start brushing in now. Not the finest, not my finest work, but it's okay. Okay, so I tried to do the two braids, but that didn't work. So I think I'm just gonna have my hair like this for the dinner. So like a slick back pony with like two strands out. I've never actually done that before. Usually I do like a normal ponytail with two strands, but I guess tonight we're gonna go for a slick back with two strands. I actually bought this thing, it's cool. It's basically like a gel, but like on a stick. It's like perfect for slick backs. So you can just use it to pull all your flyaways like in, you know? Yeah, other than that, I think the hair is basically done because the braids did not work, which is so sad. I was super excited to do that because I've seen so many people do that braid thing. So I was like so excited to try it, but I guess it just doesn't work on my hair or I don't know how to do it. I don't think I'm going to put too much effort in making it look perfect. We're just going for like simple sushi for dinner. So I don't think I used to be anything. Big. I think that's basically my hair done. What do you think? I like it. That's basically the fit. Mm -hmm. I just walked out of the bathroom and now it's dark outside. Let's check what time it is. Um, oh, it's 6.30. We have, we have so much time. Okay, I think I'm gonna clean my room and then I'll give you like a final fit check. This is the final fit for the night. The shirt these shorts and then I'll probably wear a pair of shoes. I don't know which ones yet, but yeah. Okay, I guess that's the end of the vlog because I'm done getting ready. I don't think there's really much else to film. So yeah, that's the end of the vlog. The next vlog I film will probably be traveling back to London. So yeah, see you guys at the airport, I guess.